Chris. Well, a landmark business in Morro Bay is closing shop at the end of September. Fox 26 reporter Rich Rodriguez explains beachfront kites, surreys and more is quitting due to the economy and skyrocketing rent. The owner of beachfront kites, surreys and more likes to say his business is the most colorful in Morro Bay. Sean Farmer has owned the shop since 1998. The past two years have been tough to stay afloat. The last couple of years, I've been putting money out of my savings into the kite shop thinking, oh, it'll come back, it'll come back, we'll do all right. But it's not. This summer was one of the worst summers we've had. Farmer had the same landlords for 25 years. But when they passed away, the building sold. And he says the new owners tripled the rent. Now he's paying $40,000 a year just to open the doors. Inflation also compounded the problem. Used to be people would come in and they family say, oh, everybody get a kite or a beach bucket and let's go to the beach. Well, now they come in and they're getting one kite, and one beach toy, and they're going to the beach. Farmer claims people from the Central Valley have kept him in business for 26 years. He considers them his bread and butter. I'd like to thank all the people from the Central Valley that have come to Morro Bay over the years and come visit our shop. Beachfront Kites isn't the only Morro Bay business feeling the financial pinch. Farmer says two other shops are going out of business. The final day for Beachfront Kites, Surrey's and more is September 30th. Rich Rodriguez, Fox 26 News. An absolute institution. Sean Farmer and his wife did create the Morro Bay Kite Festival in 2007. He says the annual event will fly again next April. Hi, I'm Monty Torres with Fox 26 News on YouTube. Thank you for checking out our YouTube channel, where we have loads of great content for you to choose from. And while you're here, why not click on the subscribe button right here? That way you can stay in touch with all the latest breaking news, everything news related within the Central Valley. And thank you for watching.